depending on where you're watching us from good morning good afternoon good evening and welcome to wax media tv this is our very first episode of monday two cents with me francis masinde so happy new year guys <laughs> Now what we do in our Monday to Sunday is we get to recap the week that was or the few days or anything that may have been trending in the news uh, that concerns Nairobi and Kenya because we are actually shooting from Nairobi. Then after that, myself or any other influential person we just get to give words of encouragement to just kick start your week in a way that should be. And uh, just wish you a lovely week. So um here we go. <laughs> We start on a sad note though, because uh, uh, we lost a dear friend, our very own former Prime Minister lost his son, his very first born child, Fidel, who was a friend of mine, a lovely, gentle guy, and uh, such a sad day, I mean, a time when we should be telling each other Happy New Year, something like this happens to your family or you, I mean, it's a terrible thing, but we are sorry for the family, the fingers. Former Prime Minister Mama Aida, Junior, Winnie, Rosie, our hearts go out to you. The Rex team is praying for you. And uh, the hope can be there for you in whatever way that you give us fit. But on a more interesting but somewhat funny note, a young 25 year old youth has been sentenced to two years in jail brutally insulting the president of our Republic of Kenya. Why would you do that? His name is Alan Mwadi. I personally read some of those social media updates because actually he insulted the president through social media. You do not want to do that. You cannot get away with that. I mean, why, why, why would you say that? So, he pleaded guilty, sentenced to two years in jail. It is 2015, so... He is not having a good time. I mean, you cannot say, say Happy New Year to Alan Mwadi right now. He's going to be out in 2017, and you know what? That's when we're going to probably be having a new president. So, Alan, see you in 2017. Maybe the new president will give you a presidential pattern. No, no, no. Actually, your time will be up. So, I guess we'll see you on the streets. But, youth out there, if you want to criticize the government or give your opinion. I think you want to be very objective with your words. You can't get away with none of that now. The cyber cops are gonna catch up with you. Yeah. Well wait for it, wait for it. I have something for you. You know, as Vex Media we start our year on a high. Not read really high but high. Cause uh you know what? This being our very first episode of Monday Two Cents, I got lucky. I don't get to give you words of encouragement by myself. I got an icon with me. This is a legend, a successful vocalist. She sold millions of albums. She has two Grammys to her name, Latin Grammys, three music video awards, 10 Juno awards, the commander of the order of Prince Henry, you need to Google that word. Ah, she's worked with Justin Timberlake, Timberland, Missy Elliott, and our very own Kenyan Boys Choir, who are, by the way, working with Wax Media. Uh huh. You gotta recognize. I mean, she's the one and only Nelly Furtado, and we get to do the Monday Two Cents, the very first 2015 Monday Two Cents with Nelly Furtado, y'all. This is what Nelly and I have to say for you. Please make sure your week is just as positive as it should get. Watch this. Okay. 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 Yeah. Say yeah. yeah. action. Action. Hi, everybody. And uh, today we'll do our Monday Two Cents with... I can't believe I'm going to say this, but Nelly Furtado. Hello! Hi everybody at Wex Media. I'm Nelly and I'm here in Kenya today. Lucky me. <laughs> yes, and uh, <laughs> what are you going to say to our guys? Uh, just giving them some encouragement for the new year ahead. Oh, okay. New, new year, year ahead. 
creativity, new beginnings, music, love, art. They all go together. So just try to channel positivity into everything you create. That's what I try to do. Um, and be real, be honest, but always try to channel the positivity because um, it always pays off because what goes around comes around, believe me. I know. And the moment you get negative, the negativity comes right back at you. <laughs> yeah, indeed. And you know everybody's trying to set up goals for the new year. Mm -hmm. Just make sure your goals are, goals are smart, simple, measurable, attainable, realistic, and time-bound. Don't keep doing goals every other year, every other year without timing them. By this month, by this week, by this end of such and such time, you need to have achieved it. It takes which, hard work. Mm -hmm. Which brings me to my goal for this year, which is time management. I'm going to work on that. <laughs> Indeed. I have a lot of goals I'm going to share with you in my next episode. Stay tuned. We're going to have more because we got more. Happy New Year. To me too. Sawa, sawa. All right. Hey.